Let's watch the round of 16 matches played between Trip365 and BNA in the GP365 and France versus Italian X-Men Tournament in Tennis Slash, a sports game published by Wide Live Studios. Trip to C5 is going to play with his favorite uh, play style, the counter puncher style. He's uh, going to use uh, ABK. Now nobody is playing with Kaito or Florence anymore. In level 9 capping tournaments, it is a capping of 9 tournament here, which is uh, the old challenger tournament and now the junior tournament. As for BNA, one of the best high star big forehand players of GP2 X5 and France Club. He's going to test for fun with Leo in this first match. He usually plays with Victoria and a lot of players are afraid of him, of his Victoria in 2-8. It makes me laugh because a lot of them use special strings even if they know very well that uh, Victoria's of uh, BNA is always using nylon into 8 so it starts very well for the ABK of uh, Trip to 65 and that's totally understandable indeed it's very hard for high serve big forehand players to fight versus ABK and we see a very good example here Leo is not a good test for BNA. 1-0 for 365. For the second match, BNA is switching to Victoria, his favorite character. So agility is not too high for this Victoria. As for 365, he's keeping the Yoruba string. Thing seems to be better for BNA with this uh, stronger forehand of Victoria. However, it's not so easy because the serve start is not so high for Victoria here. And you have to be accurate in all shots almost. Nice anticipation there from 365, who knows the gameplay of uh, BNA very well because <laughs> both play in GP365 and France Men Club. Trying to run foot first for 365 and then the other corner. Classic, but that works pretty well. And now I love to see Victoria, my favorite character, to go on Fury mode and hit those missiles. The problem is that it can last only for a short moment. Generally, and that's the big problem for Victoria, that doesn't stand on a long period very simply because Abike has a lot of stamina. Very nice drop there from BNA. So if you see emojis, laughing emojis, sent by both players, know that it's not aggressive at all. They are good friends, and this is only two clubmates having fun in this round of 16. So they play seriously, of course. But Oh, surprising from BNA to be so inaccurate. But yeah, they still try to have some fun with emojis. That is typical. <laughs> the crying emoji. Normally, if that was two players of uh, two different clubs things would not be so well seen but here is purely friendship very strong shots but Abigail is everywhere unbelievable she's made for that 
this match is going to be a long one. A lot of uh, comebacks, uh, equalizations from both sides. Very nice drop, a counter drop, and Victoria got the last word. <laughs> Funny seeing them having fun. Wow, very nice cross court shot there. A desperate shot from Victoria. Too bad that couldn't have changed everything. Let's see if uh, Victoria is not going to regret that. Victoria is now running out of stamina. And Abigail still has a lot of stamina. And that's too bad for Victoria of BNA. The ABK of uh, 3265 had more stamina. 3265 is now leading 2 0. Long matches are not made for Victoria for sure. So BNA seeing that uh, he had no future with uh, Leo or Victoria. Switch to ABK. So he's not uh, an expert of the counter puncher style yet because he has started playing it only recently, but he's not bad at all. And he plays even better now versus the uh, moment he was playing those round of 16 matches versus Trip 365. That was a long time ago. I'm sorry I can't publish those matches earlier. But well, better later than never, right? So BNA loves to use uh, backhand counter strings having long catch. As for Trifty 65, he prefers strings having critical shots. So the problem for uh, BNA is that uh, his ABK is going to have a stamina shield tier 2 only. And if he activates long catch a lot, that will be detrimental for his ABK's endurance. However, it's 7 points format matches that players uh, play in this tournament, so that's not so serious to play with long catch and stamina shield tier 2 <laughs> very nice counter drop there from 3265 it was a nice defense from 3265 but it was not enough Very nice shot there from BNA, who has the occasion to come back to 1-2 uh, in this round of 16. And indeed, he made it. 2-1 now for Trips 65. Let's see if uh, BNA can surf on that confidence. Of course, he's not going to change now that he sees that uh, Playing with the counter puncher style is giving him a better chance. Trifty six five has switched to the tiger card to have a better chance to hit critical shots. Right now it doesn't seem to work much. Critical doesn't activate. He saw that this stamina shield tier 3 was not so useful. It was not protecting much. <laughs> Both players know each other pretty well. And that's why they uh, read the hinted pattern of each other quite fast. Playing Hosku shot a lot. Very nice there from BNA to 
hit cross cross shots and then accelerate the other side pretty well play front trip 65 who couldn't return correctly that very strong shot from bna so bna can switch from high serve big forehand uh, to counter puncher quite easily as you can see and that's normal it's very often the case for high serve big forehand players especially a high serve big forehand specialist to switch with success to the counter puncher style the contrary is not always true it's not always easy for a specialist of counter puncher to play with high step big forehand. BNA has uh, succeeded in equalizing. Now it's 2-2 two, two and a new round of 16 starts. Let's see who is going to lead now. Let's watch the fifth match. Trifty 5 is coming back to the lucky seventh string. So you can see that BNA chose to play with more stamina and less agility. More stamina is helpful for him so that he can use a, a backhand counter string having long catch, like the hurt string. Otherwise the hand stats are the same for both players. Thrifty so I had a problem to swipe there. It's just that uh, Thrifty Six Five has more agility and less stamina. Wow! Very fair play from BNA, who has given back the previous point. He saw that 365 had problems to swipe. Yeah, only the long cash could save a BNA from those critical shots, but it was not enough. Well played from 365 nice defense there from 365 who almost succeeded his hold up with that uh, cross court drop unfortunately for him it caught the net <laughs> they love to hit <laughs> those cross course shots and a classic attack on the forehand of a big K. Too bad for BNA. He fell in hitting in that very strong shot at the end. The trip six five is now leading three two. Same stats for this sixth match. So for this one, Trip Six Five uh, had the problem with uh, his recording app, and so we see only the replay of the match. The replay provided by Tennis Clash app. Nice first rally. Accuracy of both players uh, is rather good. Well, just when I say that. In this round of 16, not so many unforced errors. Yeah, it was too hard there for 365 to return into the bounds.
Yeah, BNA starts to know a bit how to see these five hits. Of course, 55 knows as well how BNA loves to hit when he plays with uh, the counter punch style. BNA is in danger now. He has to, wow, to save three match points. That will not be easy at all for him. Nice, he has saved one of them. Still to, to save. Looks hard, tough. Yeah, indeed. With this ultimate cross court winner, Trifty C5 qualifies for the next round where he will face the auto idol. Too bad for BNA. I think that he could have had a better chance if he played all matches in this round of 16 using Abeke. Well, I hope you enjoy watching the round of 16 matches played between 3365 and BNA in the GP35 and France versus Italian X-Men tournament in Tennis Slash, a sports game published by Wildlife Studios. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel on Gameplay365 and to turn on the bell to stay tuned for new videos of the tournament. Thank you a lot for your support and see you soon on Gameplay365. Bye-bye.